Good morning. Oh, someone's looking at me through the window. Good morning again. We're gonna do another college vlog today. It's Tuesday for me, which is my least busy day as far as classes go. The first thing I do is go to the communal bathroom because I always drink a lot of water right before I go to bed and I brush my teeth and wash my face first thing. So I'm up and at them for the rest of the day. <clears throat> I used to have an electric toothbrush, but I left it the last time I was out of town. So now I'm back to handheld. My dentist would be upset. This doesn't have any active ingredients in it, but it keeps my skin pretty clean and it's helped out with oil too. I'm surprised there's no hair in the drain. As far as outfits go, I usually just do some shirts and some jeans. If you watched my other vlogs, you know that my closet really never changes, so this isn't gonna be very interesting. We'll do this little tank. This I got a while ago and cut it. I guess I'll find some pants. I also always like to wear some rings to make myself feel dressed up. I've never really felt comfortable in leggings and stuff for some reason. I think it's because I'm pretty small, so whenever I wear really tight-fitting stuff, it makes me feel even smaller, and then I just, I don't know, I don't feel my age. So I've always been a jean wearer, but one tip, if you don't, really feel good in what you're wearing is just wear some pretty light jewelry because no matter what whenever i have a ring on or a cute necklace i feel better <laughs> about myself but I drink the sink water. That sounds so disgusting when I say it out loud. I got a lot of really helpful tips about how to reduce waste as far as coffee goes. I didn't realize that K-cups were so bad for the environment, but it makes sense because they're all individually packaged into these little plastic containers and then you just throw them out afterwards. So I kind of, you know, got the hint too late that I should just be buying a reusable K-cup. That's on its way, which is exciting. But while I wait, I am going to have to continue to kill the environment. And today we are going to kill it with some dark roast. I went grocery shopping yesterday and I found this almond milk creamer, but it's pumpkin spice flavored. So I bought it to celebrate the first day of autumn, which is today. And this is breakfast that I made for myself last night. It's kind of like a hybrid of overnight oats and chia seed pudding. So I'll show you how to make that. Look. That's the first animal I've seen in so long. Uh, I saw a dog last week, but I, I miss my pets. You'll never guess how I'm filming this, guys.
I'm plant-based while in college, which I've been really liking. I've been eating this way for a really long time. As far as breakfast goes, I always eat something pretty filling in the morning, usually with fiber and protein, so it kind of lasts. This is a cup of oats, a tablespoon of chia seeds, a cup of oat milk, and some sweetener. This one has a mashed up banana in it and then some cut up strawberries, but I don't have a banana for tomorrow, so I think I'm just gonna sweeten it with some protein powder. And then I just pop it in my fridge overnight and it's, it's really good. I just got an email. I have mail. This is the mail center. No one's ever in here. But I like to ship myself packages every now and then, so some days I wake up with an email in my inbox. It feels like Christmas, so I have no idea what I ordered. Let's check. Dun da da da! It's peanut butter. College is really stressful, honestly. I'm gonna park real quick. There's just a lot of busy work because everything's over Zoom. So what the school lacks in in-person instruction, they make up for with assignments that don't really help. I have a lot to do on the days that I actually have class. So when I don't, I really, um, I like to take advantage of it. This thing is falling. But that should work. Anyway, we're gonna go thrift shopping. <laughs> Banger! We have arrived at America's Thrift Store. Let's go. It was successful. Lunch ends in 15 minutes, so I'm gonna rush. It ends in four minutes, I'm so nervous. I missed it. So I got myself an orange. I guess we'll cook. So when I get home, I did a quick workout, just a 30 minute one, which I try to do, you know, a couple times a week, maybe three or four. I normally don't cook my meals. I actually have a meal plan here, which is why most of the foods that I make on TikTok and stuff are snacks. I really do like to cook and mess around in the kitchen, but I don't really think I could afford making all three meals in a dorm room every day. So I usually just buy ingredients 
for breakfast and then snacks. And then I have emergency things in my freezer. And then I have my weekly cry. And then I remembered that it was Tuesday, which is the only day out of the week that I have an in-person class. And I was running late, so I ran. I realized that I wasn't gonna make it, so I just ended up sitting in the middle of the quad and attending over Zoom, which is okay. It was just a little bit unplanned. <laughs> On my way back, I grabbed dinner and I made it that time. And then I took a shower. So yeah, that was my evening. Once I finish these, I'm gonna wash some clothes, I think, and try on the things that I thrifted. I never got the chance to, and I'm really curious to see what they look like on. They're very fall themed. I haven't done laundry in a really long time, so we'll see if I can fit everything into the machine. Onwards. This took a lot longer than I thought it would. I waited an hour because I thought the dryer was going and it wasn't. So, you know, it's pretty late. It's about 1 a.m. Washing clothes is an interesting thing for me. I always kind of throw everything in and cycle it with cold water and then I dry it on medium. And because I mix all my colors, I just hope for the best. Today, I would rate my washing skills about a six out of 10. There's a little bleeding going on here, but you know, hopefully it's just this pair. All right, it's fashion show time. Item number one, this red corduroy jacket. And number two, this jean shirt. This is actually my favorite. It has this stitching and this little collar here. Very autumn. It has potential. Imagine this cut like that and then with some cute pants. I think, I think it could be something. I also found this black shirt, which is nothing special, but it's form fitting, which is, which is new for me. Here are those shoes that I found. <sighs> yeah. <sighs> well, anyway, I'm gonna go to bed now, wash my face, brush my teeth, get some REM. I wasn't planning on staying up this late, but I think I got a lot accomplished today. As always, I'll see you next time. I hope you had a good day. Just know that if you're feeling lonely or down in any way, you're not alone. I think everyone kind of dips sometimes, especially recently. It's just so easy to feel like you're isolated, but you're not. And if you can't really get out of that mindset, go to America's Thrift Store and buy yourself a mason jar. I'll see you next time.